about this is the kind of setup we would do if we had an IED or something like that. We would call that water charge into the box and tear it apart. They've got some cool stories here. Made me rethink my, my life as a machine gunner, honestly. <laughs> how about, but how then about again, you? anytime blowing stuff up is a good thing, regardless of what, what branch of service, if we're blowing stuff up, it's a good day. Exactly. Here. Have you found yours? No, uh, we drove over an anti-tank mine, so they've got I'm, one in here. I'm not even sure what that looks like. Where is it? You, uh, Iraq or Afghanistan? Iraq. Iraq. Probably this one. Yes, 2.2. It might have been a TC6. Italian made. Yeah, Italian uh, plastic, low metal, about 14 pounds each of uh, TNT. Yeah, for as little as that is, it. Really yeah. screwed our truck up. Well, lots of times here, a bomber to Humvee. I've actually got pictures of it out in the truck. It's that flat hole. Humvee's still under so well. Well, and, and right where the pressure came through is right where the, the front firewall plate came yeah. off and then stopped. And it breached right there. Right, right, right above the, right below the heater core, mm -hmm. and right above that plate came right through and just ripped my leg right off. Yeah. Did it get in your grill at all? Looking at a mock-up of one. Oh, Oh no, not at all. No. It's right place, right time. Uh, I'm blessed. I, I truly believe that it all it all happened for a reason. Uh, I wouldn't take my leg back for nothing. Hoorah. Hoorah.